Hi, I'm Lucy from HMS. Oh. I'm an eighth grader. Oh, yeah. <sighs> okay, my poem is called Focus. TikTok, only 30 minutes left. I wonder what we're doing in science. Wait, what did she say? This class is boring. Do we have homework? Ooh, 20 minutes left. That's my brain. It struggles constantly with being untasked and focused. If I become focused, I end up staring at something random. I was just staring at the word focus. Ironic, right? I have ADHD. More specifically, an attentive ADHD. An attentive ADHD is when you have poor focus, poor listening skills, and overall forgetfulness. It's a disorder to the brain and there is no cure. In to answer the silent questions, my ADHD does not cause me to bounce off the walls. My brain is bouncing off the walls. There are hundreds of thousands of words in the English language. These are the words I hear most. Focus, focus, focus Lucy. Lucy, do you understand? Do you remember what I told you? Come on, Lucy. Those are words I'm told constantly because of reasons I cannot control. They said I'm like invalid because of my ADHD. To be able to focus, I take a single pill. The fact this single pill can change my entire life is amazing. With the single pill, I become normal. Things people take for granted are something that I can never achieve. I have split personalities with my brains. My ADHD brain is crazy. My medicated brain is focused and calm. Both brains can accomplish one thing together, reading. My ADHD brain is the winner of that competition. When you can't focus on basic things, you find other things to do. Reading was the only thing that worked. My ADHD devours, brains and devours books in its sight. My medicated brain tries to keep up, but it can't read for hours without getting distracted, like my ADHD brain can. Overall, I am not me on my medicated brain. I'm a Lucy who sits, reads, maybe says a little. But ADHD Lucy is loud and crazy and you don't know what's happening. So to all the people, my family, my friends, my teachers, who I wasn't paying attention to, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I, you thought I didn't care. I care about what most people are saying. I'm sorry. My brain isn't quite set up right. It's like a broken IKEA chair that you lost the instructions to. Really, my brain should be apologizing. My brain should apologize for never being able to do my homework in an acceptable amount of time. My brain should apologize for, being, for me every time being scolded for not focusing. My brain shouldn't have to apologize for not being perfect, and neither should I.